three years in prison and a fine of more than $112,000, a fine for the former Egyptian president, Mohamed Morsi, on charges of inciting the Egyptian judiciary. This comes in a series of attacks and verbal accusations to um, the integrity of the Egyptian judiciary from the Egyptian um, president. One of them was in a public speech on a televised live broadcast when he was president back in 2012, where he named a judge and accusing him of corruption without providing any evidence. Um, the other instance came as he, he has been subject to several trials and he, have he has refused um, to to accept the authority uh, of the, um, the, the court in, in insisting that he is still um, the legitimate president of Egypt. Um, former President Mohamed Morsi is also facing several other court cases. Uh, one of them he has received a definite and a final verdict of 20 years in prison for accusations of involvement in attacking peaceful protesters uh, when he was president. Um, at least seven were killed in clashes between his supporters and opposition. Uh, powers uh, at the presidential palace. Uh, the court has found that the former president was involved in inciting violence against the protesters. Uh, and when um, the former president, Mohamed Morsi, filed a request for an appeal, it was rejected. Uh, beside that, he has received a life sentence in prison and a death penalty, but both of them are still subject to an appeal. One of them, one of these trials will be held uh, next year. Uh, the former president is accused of fleeing prison and um, and, as, and I have espionage charges with Qatar, the state of Qatar, leaking defense and national security information uh, to the state of Qatar. Um, the other espionage case is with the Palestinian base group Hamas, through which he is accused of inciting them to come to Egypt and hold hostile attacks against the country. Adil Mahrui, CGTN, Cairo.